Hello there, this is Kilgaki's Swords at Dragon and Princess's support with a help video about how to get your game HUD and how to start and complete your first game of Dragon and Princess's. As you can see here, I have the Dragon and Princess's website. And if I click here, we've got Second Life and I'm at the Dragon and Princess's central location. And we have some information boards here. First one is about the level scheme. One here if you need help. One with instructions how to play. And also one here that explains earning money. As you can see here we also have the game chest where you can click on to earn your lindens. Now if you don't currently have a HUD and you would like one you can click on a game server as long as it's not your own game server because if it was obviously it would give you instructions about setting up a game. Click touch. As you can see here an object named Dragon and Princess Storage, owned by Dragon and Princess's resident, has given you an object named Dragon and Princess's Hut. Where me? Click Keep. As you can see here, it's been delivered to my SL inventory. If I click on it with my second mouse button, it'll go into your objects folder. By the way, if you click on with your second mouse button and click Where, as you can see. The HUD will appear in the top left hand corner of my screen. If you wait till the HUD is loaded and then you click on the server again, the game requires one player and takes one minute. Do you want to join this game? I would click yes. As you can see here, the game has started. Find the rift. Once you find the rift, you've got to click on the rift to repair it. As you can see here, we have a distance meter. As I go over here, it tells me it's 17 meters away. As you can see, the color of the arrows as well. As I get closer to the rift, it's going to become brighter. And as you can see, the distance is going down as well. So I'm getting closer. Now, if I go around here, it's telling me that it's up the stairs. So if I click here, and click Roof, as you can see, it teleports me to the roof where I've found the rift. And again, you can see it's getting very, it's getting brighter as I get closer. And also, the arrow gets bigger until I'm directly standing over it. Also, the distance will then say here. If I now click the rift to repair it, as you can see here it says all rifts have been found, the game is starting now. Click OK. As you can see here we have a game timer. And it's now counting down. I'll just ask you to pay attention to some things here. We have the experience bar. We have your level. We also have the arrow and the distance here. We have your dragon's gold. And we have group member because I'm already in the group. As you can see here, we're just waiting now for the game timer to count down. The game timer has now counted down as you can see here, congratulations the game is complete, your points and earnings have been added to your balance, click OK.
as you can see here I've now came down the stairs back out to the front and we have the game chest if I now just click on the game chest and get money as you can see your balance is less than 100 dragon gold I've got 57 dragon gold complete some more games to get paid click ok now obviously if I had more than 100 dragon gold there I would have able to claim Melindans for my dragon gold thanks for playing dragon and princesses take care have a great day